Hi everyone, today I would love to share with you this beautiful granny square pattern. It's super easy to make it. All we need is a magic ring or you can chain five and then chain three and start the pattern. The pattern is super easy. Three double crochet, one treble, three double, one treble. So in total you will have four trebles and three double crochet in between of them. And then the next row you are going to make an increase of two double crochet, one treble, two double crochet into the same stitch. So you are forming the corner and you will have four corners. So here instead of treble we will use chain three and uh, as you can see you repeat the same row but because of the increase the square is getting bigger and bigger and you can have any size you wish to so let me share with you how to make it i love magic rings i'm not going to use the chain of five but you can use chain of five and then slip stitch we are going to make a magic ring why I prefer the magic ring is because you can close the center very well. As you can see here, you practically have no hole because you can always pull this end and the hole is completely closed. And now after you make your magic ring, chain one, two and three and over and make three double crochet one two and three now we are going to make a treble so yarn over two times and pull through two, pull through two, and pull through two third time. That's your treble. Now you are going to make three double crochet. One, two, and three. We are going to make another treble. In total we will have four trebles because we have four corners. So this is one. The chain of three at the beginning is one treble, two, three. So make three double crochet. One, two, You can pull a bit this yarn to close a bit and we are going to make our last treble so make two times yarn over pull through two three times and another side of three double crochet one So you can see that we created a square. Now slip stitch into the third chain. So one, two, three. The top of chain three that we made at the beginning. Just insert the yarn and pull through the top and through the loop on the hook. That's our first row and now we are starting the second row that will be the same like all the other rows. You chain three. Now find the stitch where you just slip stitched and make an increase of two double crochet. One and 
another double crochet into the same stitch so you already have chain three and two double crochet from the same stitch and now just continue with stitch it was a treble of the previous row you are going to make first an increase so two double crochet into the same stitch make another treble in the in the same stitch another double crochet still in that stitch and another double crochet in that stitch oh my gosh we have five stitches from the same treble of the previous row so this is the treble you can see it's different from others and we have five stitches two double crochet one treble two double and now we are going to make three double crochet And we have arrived to another treble and you repeat you have to make two double crochet so one and another one another treble and two double crochet so in total five stitches from into the same travel to the same stitch and now again you make three double crochet one two three so after that we arrive to another travel and we are going to repeat what we learned so it's very easy two double crochet one treble and two double crochet and all of that in the same stitch so five stitches from the treble of the previous row into the treble of the previous row you can see it has a square shape so one two and practically that's it I could uh, finish the tutorial because that's what you have to do to repeat this row but if you want I can show you another row so the next row as you remember chain three one two three into the same stitch where you got the chain of three you are going to make an increase sometimes not that easy because it's slip stitch stitch so you make two double crochet and then now we are going to have one so uh, 2 plus 2 4 7 you must have 7 double crochet until the next corner and in the next corner we are going to repeat the same thing so just when you see the treble you have to repeat the increase part so let me recount three six seven yes here is the treble and i'm going to make an increase so two double crochet a treble
to the double crochet and you continue so as you can see each row you will have more double crochet because we're making this increase that will make the side longer and each time you can continue to make this increase of two double crochet one travel two double crochet until you have the square size that you want it can be as big as you want you can crochet the whole carpet like that if you wish to and just this one row pattern will make you this perfect solid square so that's it for today thanks for watching and i hope to see you next time